A we back with more Ovalbot video. Today I'm going to be talking about how much money you can get in an hour. I was going to do a day, but then I realised it's not really a fair comparison because you cannot spend a full 24 hours grinding on Ovalbot. Um, but I get a lot of people saying, oh it's really difficult to get money and how, how do you get so much and you know all the rest of it. Uh, and most importantly, I get people that just don't seem to understand that you just have to type commands. I'm, I'm sorry to say, it. you just have to type commands. That is how you get the money, you type the commands. Um, but the question is how much money you can get. And that's what we're going to find out today. We're going to be using mostly this little chart here. If you want to find this chart, it is in the pinned messages of the official OOBot Discord server, um, which you can find on Google. So just Google it. This shows uh, the percentage chance up here of getting all the types of animals. This is your main source of income. We could talk about daily and voting, and I will mention them, but for the most part, animals is going to be your main source of income. Uh, since it is listed on the chart, I will briefly mention gambling. Um, obviously, coin flip has a 50-50 chance of winning, so you're making no money off that. And if you're wondering, I calculated the percentage chance of winning this, it is 47.5%. So in other words, you on average will lose the slots if you play slots. Um, blackjack is, I, I'm pretty sure it's rigged, I, I've never done maths on the Ouroboot Blackjack specifically, but obviously regular Blackjack is rigged because it's like actually played in casinos, so yes. Um, coin flip is your best chance if you want to gamble, but you are no, making no money off it in average, so we are not going to be discussing gambling today. Um, the same applies to the lottery. Realistically, you're making no money off the lottery either. Uh, so first we're going to work out how many animals you can get, and then we're going to work out how much they are worth. Uh, let's start by having a look at Huntbot, um, because that is an excellent method of getting animals. Now I have a maxed Huntbot, except for Radar of course, uh, so we can use this as a nice reference point. In 24 hours, you can get 5,760 animals from Huntbot. So I have ye olde calculator here, and if you plug into this, 5,760 divided by 24, this is how many animals you get per hour from maxed Huntbot. Let's assume you've got maxed Huntbot. Sure, 240 animals per hour. That is, let's face it, not that great. Um, it sounds like a, a lot when you're getting a whole 6,000, um, but you look at this per hour value, you can get that pretty easily with a few hunts. And that's what we're going to be looking at next. So we've got our 240. What else do we get? Well, if I do a hunt here, I am going to get 16 animals because I have legendary hunting gem. Um, now let's suppose... Oh, I actually got a gem one. How nice. Um, let's suppose you have a fabled hunting gem. We're going to for, go for the maximum amount that you can get. So we're going to assume you've got Fabled Hunting Gem. Fabled Hunting Gem, kind of hard to get. Personally, I only use Legendaries. Fabled is, is rare. But let's suppose you always have Fabled ones. You're super lucky and you've got loads of Fabled Hunting Gems. That means you get 20 animals per hunt. Now, the cooldown for hunting, we can demonstrate this here. 12.5 seconds there. I'm pretty sure it's actually 14 seconds. Um, which uh, this seems to demonstrate reasonably well. It might be 13, I'm, I'm not sure, but let's go with 14. Let's say you can hunt every 14 seconds. It's something like that. And of course, it takes you time to type it, so you're being really optimal if you're hunting every 14 seconds, you know. Um, in fact, let's round it up to 15 from the, for, for the time to type, okay? 15 seconds, because that'll be nicer on the maths anyway. If you can hunt once every 15 seconds, that means you can hunt four times in a minute. So we bring up the calculator again, four times in a minute. We've got 60 minutes in an hour, so we want four times 60. You are hunting 240 times per minute. It's the same amount again. That's kind of funky. Back before gems were added, I guess you could get the same amount from Huntbot and from regular hunting, but we have gems. So this is how many times you can hunt. Now watch this, we add on the gems, we are getting a lot more animals per hour than the hunt bot. You see that? That means you only need to hunt manually once every five minutes and you will get as many animals as hunt bot gets all day. That's not that often, realistically, you know? Not that often. 20 times less, that means you could hunt, like, hunt just for an hour straight every day, 
and you would get what Huntbot gets. An hour isn't super long. I mean, personally, I'm not going to spend an hour grinding on a robot, but if you want to, you're doubling your Huntbot already. Doubling a maxed Huntbot, mind. Totally doable. Anyway, let's add on the 240 from Huntbot. We are now at 5,040 animals per hour, this is. Right, per hour. 5,000 animals. Now what we need to work out is how much those animals are worth, which is where we come to our comprehensive chart here. Sorry, my calculator's getting in the way now. Let's move it down a little bit. Let's work out how much these animals are worth. Um, we are getting 5,040 animals. Common chance. We'll assume you haven't got Patreon, so we'll ignore these. We'll also assume that you are not getting bot ones, because they're super rare and only from Huntbot. We'll assume you aren't getting distorted, because they're rare and requires distorted to be available. And we'll assume you aren't getting event animals, because, again, there, it depends if there's an event available. Um, also, for gems, I don't know what the percentage chance is. No one does, as you can see here. But I'm almost certain that at least when you have a high-tier lucky gem, they are at least more common than legendaries. Uh, so to go for a safe bet, we'll just say it's the same percentage chance as legendary. Because then we, we know we're not overestimating. It's better to underestimate, you know. Uh, so yeah, we'll say that they've got the same percentage chance as legendaries, and we'll assume that you've got a good hunting gem, as, uh, sorry, a good lucky gem as well as a good hunting gem. So, in our calculator here, we've got our 5,040. We are going to be multiplying this by the certain amounts uh, from our uh, grid here. So we've got 5,040. We're going to times that by this uh, 58.8489. There you go. Um, divide that by 100. That is how much you get from common animals. So let's just write that down here in Discord. We'll round it up to 2,966 from common animals. Okay. Now let's do rares, you see. Uh, now commons, obviously, as it says, are worth one. Rares are worth three. So while this, we can just times it by 0 0.3, actually. That's probably a little easier. We'll times it by 0 0.3. But then we also want to times it by three. So there we go, 4,536 from Uncommons. 4,536. I'm just going to go through all of these and add them all up. Now remember, when it comes to gem animals, we're not including those 240 from Huntbot because Huntbot cannot get gem animals. So we are back down to our uh, 4,800 here. Uh, that one is going to be times by 0 0.05, divided by 100, and then times by the whole... 30,000 can we get there? Whole 72,000 from them. That's a lot. The biggest so far. Okay, and there you have it. That is how much money you get from selling animals every hour. Seems like a lot, doesn't it? You know why? That's because it is a lot. It's because if you sit there and you type out commands frequently, you will get a lot of money. This is what I keep saying. Just need to be running out those commands. A lot. Often. Uh, not that I do, but that's why I don't make much money. Now, if you want to be like that, I can add on a couple of extra, because we have our daily. That's an extra 1,000, but remember, this is going by hour. So we've got plus an extra 1,000. Uh, wait, I need brackets here. An extra 1,000 divided by 24. You see how that is not much? Yeah, so that barely made any difference. Realistically, your daily isn't making a whole lot of difference. Uh, and now you have your vote. Vote's an interesting one, because vote you can get a lot more on. Vote, uh, as we can see, if I have a look at my own vote here, um, goes up by three every time you vote. Mine's almost at 3,000, but theoretically, it could be a lot higher than that. So. Let's calculate what your maximum vote could be. Let's first work out how long it's been since this system was added. Now, of course, I know when the system was added because I have it back when I used to use the bot. Now, it used to go up every five, but then after a while it reset 
and started going up every three. Ah, we see that here. Went back down to 235 and started going up every three. That was on the 22nd of July, 2018. So how many days has it been since then? Okay, so according to online date calculator, this was 1,107 days ago. But of course, we can vote every 12 hours, so we need to double that to get 2,214. This is how many times we could have voted. So let's just assume you did all of them. Like I said, we're going for the maximum possible amount of currency here. So what we're going to do, we're going to times that by 3. And we're going to add on this original 235 over here. That is how much you would get per vote every 12 hours. You can now uh, divide that by 12 to see how much you get per hour, and it's an extra 573, which brings us to a grand total of 178,397. That is how much money you can expect to get on a robot every hour if you consistently hunt Assuming that you're not insanely lucky with animals. Obviously, if you get a bunch of hidden animals, you'll be doing better. Um, if you get nothing good, you'll be doing worse. But on average, that is the maximum that you could be getting per day. You notice how almost everything that we added on there is pretty inconsequential in comparison with simply hunting on the bot. This OOH command, that is by far the best way to get money. Now, here's something to note. As I have said before, your hunt bot needs essence. You want to be sacrificing the essence animals, not selling them. Because all in all, it's going to be a lot more efficient for you if you sacrifice them all first. So that is not to say that you will actually make this much money, even if you do everything correctly. Because you probably want to sacrifice your animals instead of sell them. However, that makes the essence worth more than the money, right? And if the essence is worth more than the money, you could say that given some sort of uh, exchange, you are actually making more than this if you sacrifice the animals. That's, that's kind of a debatable point, to be fair. Um, but you get what I'm saying. Right. Uh, as long as you are sacrificing your animals and you are upgrading your hunt bot, you know, upgrading your radar even. <laughs> if you've maxed out anything else. Oh, I didn't actually type the command correctly. Epic. Um, then you're probably doing well and you're probably getting lots of money. Because realistically, you don't need to be hunting that much to get lots of money. If I look at how much money I've got, it's uh, a reasonable amount. It's, it's nothing crazy. If you look at the top of the leaderboards, people have way more than that. But it's, it's pretty good, you know? I'm set when it comes to money. But do I do this? Absolutely not. I don't make nearly this much money because I basically don't hunt. All the money that I get comes from my hunt bot. And we just discussed how much money hunt bot gets you. 240 animals per hour. And it's uh, not a whole lot. Um, but it's, it's worth having, you know, for sure. It's worth having. Um, the point is that if you do decide to hunt consistently and frequently and, you know, other cool words, then you will end up with about this much money um, per hour. And that's, that's pretty good, I think. Also, just for a fun fact, in case you are interested, because I did decide to work it out, uh, when it comes to the voting, I did check how much money you would have made from voting alone if you had voted every 12 hours since they changed the voting system. It's 7,876,305. Almost 8 million just from voting. <laughs> That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Is of course nothing in comparison with the hunting. You saw that we added on, you know, an extra 573 to our massive value. But you see how over the years it makes a big difference. And also consider this, if that 8 million over the years turns into only 573, what would it be if you did it vice versa? If you'd been making this much every hour in the last three years? Just imagine. It'd be insane, wouldn't it? And of course that's not possible because you'd have to be awake 24-7 and hunting and do nothing else with your life. And unless you are a bot, in which case you are going to get banned, it's not happening. But, <coughs> 
you can see how it's not difficult to make a couple of million if you really put your mind to it. You really do the hunting. So, there you go. Inspirational. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end this one here now. Hope you enjoyed Calculator Stream. It's not a stream, it's a video, but yes. <laughs> Bye!